what's goody, what's good? You know this is your boy Andy Appleseed. Andy Appleseed TV is the name of the channel. Make sure you like, share, hit your boy with a comment. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button one time. We got the latest and greatest hip hop news in these YouTube streets. Let's get it in. Let's go. Welcome back to the Rumors, Rumors, Rumors. This is my original segment where we take the latest and greatest celebrity rumors on social media and we have a little fun with it. Everything is all alleged, so without further ado, let's jump straight into this. Welcome back to the Rumors, Rumors, Rumors. Now it's only right we set it off with one of the craziest rumors to social media. Come on, rich boy. Rumors, rumors, rumors has it. The rich boy allegedly got locked up. This was after it was announced that he got into it. This was all about a domestic dispute that went down in his house. But did you hear the details to it? Rich Boy was actually still living home with his mom at the age of 39. He got into it. I'm not too sure if they was fighting over the juice in the fridge, but it seems like they called the cops on him and he just got arrested. Now, I was said after making a hit song with Polo the Don throw some deeds on it, he did fall into some hard times. But did you guys hear about Polo the Don? Allegedly, he had a little relationship going on with Kayla Nicole on OTV. You know, the YouTuber that blew up had 5 million subscribers at the age of 17. But rumors, rumors, rumors has it, they allegedly had a relationship, it went sour, and now she's actually suing them. Shout out goes out to Charleston White, he gives it up like how he gives it up, but sometimes he just has to give it up. Now allegedly he got into a little back and forth on social media. This was with T.I.'s son and Boosie's son. Boy, Charleston White. Boosie, your boy don't know how to fight. Need to do that T.I. little you. Nobody thought, stand up, speak on my family's behalf when we being attacked. Nobody. Never. Not once. All right. Then where we at with it? Let's let it stay there. Now we all know how this is gonna end up. I don't know who's gonna check him first, but that's so tough. Try to start it yelling. Clifford Harris Jr. Like two daddies. Me and you get in the ring to give us a ninety day six month training. <laughs> Give us a 90 day six month training. Hold on, wait, wait. This just came in. A word? Okay, okay. Rumors, rumors, rumors has it. The allegedly somebody did pull up on Charles the White, man. Who really knows? But this was at a gas station. Hey, happens, man. Rumors, rumors, rumors. Shout out goes out to DJ Khaled, the king of the hype. This guy right here knows how to get a record done. They said that he would actually pull up to your house, jump through your window just to get the contract signed. You know, and Jay Z was like, man, it's, and it, it's so many dreams come true for this. For me. But rumors, rumors, rumors has it when he dropped that God did, he kind of hyped it up. He was telling everybody, you know, Drake and Jay Z actually was in on this. You know, and Jay Z was some of his favorite records on God did. Man, he just named a few off the top of his dome, of course, and God did. He made God did, woke up, just heard it through the spirits and made this song, right? Shout out goes out to the artist Friday who actually made the God did song. He was in his bedroom, the AC was broken, he had like a room that looked like a jail cell, y'all. But God did. Yeah, you know I man. Salute to Friday, one of the biggest artists coming up in the game. God did. God did. Shout out goes out to Mona Scott. Hey, Mona. Andy Appleseed. Rumors, rumors, rumors has you can always tell when Love and Hip Hop's about to come back on. Just recently on social media, photos did surface. This was Peter Guns. He got into it with Cisco again. What happened? Cisco was laid up in the hospital with his boots up. Champion. Cisco, he understood he lost. Anyway, champion of the world. But well, we gonna take this back to years ago, man. When Peter Guns was a rapper, he actually had one of the hottest songs called Deja Vu. Somebody sitting in my seat. So the Bronx is Right, what's going on? <laughs> Tell me where you from. Rumors, rumors, rumors has it. While filming this Deja Vu video, they ran into a little problem. They could not get Yankee Stadium. They had to revert, come to Queens, and film it at Shea Stadium. Now, allegedly, while filming, there was this little kid there. Seems like he jumped up, was holding up this Queen sign the whole time. Fat Joe actually stopped that kid and said, yo, who's that? Put that sign down. Now, shortly after that, the director yelled, action. What did the kid do? He jumped up, grabbed the champagne bottle from one of the guys over there. He was kind of wrestling with it. But eventually, they ended up saying, you know what, just leave them. Let them go, man. That was punning them sitting over there. All the goons were sitting there. They said they were the kids buggy, man. Now, I don't know if you heard about it, but rumors, rumors, rumors has it. That little kid right there in the video that stole the champagne bottles, beef with Fat Joe, that was Andy Appleseed, man. That was me right there, man. Rumors, rumors, rumors. Now, there's nothing wrong with spreading your seeds and taking care of your kids, man. But did you see... Rumors, rumors, rumors has it that a picture did pop up on social media. I'm not too sure who it was, man, but it did look kind of crazy, man. 
Rumors, rumors, rumors. Shout out goes out to the BT Awards this year that actually hyped it up on the performances. One award I was proud of was Glow Rilla, right? We all saw it. She actually won for the best breakthrough hip hop artist. Now they got that right, but rumors, rumors, rumors has it. Kodak Black, come on, man. He was throwing soul on Lotto. She won the BT Awards. She beat you, bro. Now she actually won for the song Big D Energy. We all know this was one of the biggest records outsold everybody was on the pop charts. But allegedly, did you guys see the track list for writers? I don't really know, but I did see Jacquees in there. There was a couple people in there. Rumors, rumors, rumors has it on Kodak's writing list. It was one person, Kodak. BDT Hip Hop Kodak Black. Shout out goes out to rapper Finesse two times. I remember when he was down bad, he was beatboxing, rapping in the jail. Everybody was rooting for him. Came home, he got a record deal. But rumors, rumors, rumors has it, after he did an interview, he actually revealed some information. This was about his ex-girlfriend, rapper Erica Banks. Shout out to Erica. Now I don't know how you could do five years, come home, dump your girlfriend. But rumors, rumors, rumors has it. He allegedly dumped her, all because she was a little bit manly. This is what he said in an interview. He said sometimes he would speak to her and she'd be like, What's up, gang? Now, fellas, would you dump your girlfriend if she was just like, One of the homies? Come on, man. Rumors, rumors, rumors. Now, I want to thank you very much for watching. It's your boy Andy Appleseed. Andy Appleseed TV is the name of the channel. If you're new here, hit that subscribe, drop me a comment. We got the latest and greatest hip hop news commentary by your boy Andy Appleseed. It's going down. Live stream edits, you name it. Hit that like, catch me in the next video. Peace.